One way ANOVA followed by post hoc test in Jamuvi. In this data view for Jamuvi, I had inserted two variables. The first one is labeled as job or profession. It is a categorical variable. There are four different groups in it. Doctors, dentist, pharmacist, and nurses. In the second column, I had inserted a salary variable. That is the salary earned annually by each individual, measured in pounds. To find out whether there is a difference in the salary among all the four groups and since we have more than two groups then one way ANOVA will be performed to determine whether there is a significant differences between those groups in terms of their salary. To do the analysis click on ANOVA, select one way ANOVA and in this window select and drag professions or job into the grouping variable and the salary into the dependent variable. On the right hand side a table is generated for one way another. That is the advantage of using Jamuvi that tables are immediately generated and they can be copied and inserted in a Word document or in a PowerPoint presentation. For the one way ANOVA, under this box here for variances, select don't assume equal variances and also take the assume equal variances. From the additional statistics, take on the descriptive table and that will lead to generation of a descriptive table as we can see here. So for the first options for variances, a data, the day for the variances of the data, a table showing one way ANOVA that compared the salary for all the four groups based on two test Welch or Welch test and Fisher test. The first test when there is no uh, equality of uh, um, variances and the second one when there is homogeneity of variances. And we can see that a p-value is generated and this is a significant. In the second table, a group description is produced for doctors, dentists, pharmacists and nurses. There were 25 participants in each group and the mean for each group is uh, calculated here with standard deviation and standard error. And from the mean we can see that the doctor have the highest salary and the nurse have the lowest salary. We could also take the descriptive plot to generate a plot that shows the mean for each group. And for the assumption check or checks, take the homogeneity test. The homogeneity test will test whether there is a homogeneity in the variances. And uh, it will produce a table here showing the homogeneity of variances test based on Levens and it will produce a p-value and it's showing here that there is homogeneity of variances and the assumption for performing one way ANOVA is met and for the second assumption which is normality test if you take that a table is generated for normality test using Shapiro Willick and that table shows that there is a normality in the data. 
So these two uh, assumptions have been met for doing the one-way ANOVA. Um, if we click into the post hoc test and scroll down, since we have here normality of data and meeting the assumptions, then for comparing all possible combination between groups, click on and select the Toki test as the data are normally distributed and have equal variances. When there is no homogeneity of variance, then games Howell will be selected. And as we see here, scroll down, a table is generated for post hoc test based on Tucky for comparing the salary and showing that the, there is a difference in the salary, significant difference in the salary between doctor and nurses, doctor and pharmacist, doctor and dentist, and also pharmacist and dentist and um, nurses with dentists and nurses with pharmacists. So this is an easy way to do one way ANOVA and generate table in Jamovi. We could also produce more plots. If we click on explore or exploration, click on descriptive, then in this new window going to move the job into the split pie and the salary into the variables and I'm going to generate descriptive table uh, variable across rows and in this descriptive table the mean is generated and the median and the SD the minimum and the maximum we could also click on statistics and we could add the confidence interval for the mean which is given here lower and upper 90 five percent confident or confidence interval for the mean we could also again do shapiro Wellick uh, test toward the end of the table here and on the plot we could select the box plot which produce a box plot for all the four groups which shows the distribution of the data in each group. We could also produce a histogram showing the distribution of the data in each uh, group and also insert a curve for that distribution. So this is the way to perform one-way ANOVA in Jamovi.